What is going on, B-Bunch? Let me catch you up to what has been going on the past few days. It's been a crazy few days. Third Thursday, you guys probably heard, there's a huge, catastrophic, category five hurricane hurling right towards us. Why are you making a bunch of faces? Thursday, we ran to the store and grabbed a bunch of supplies. So after we ran, ran to the store to get supplies, then we went, waited for Bella to get out of school, ran down to my mom's house, because at that point the storm was coming right for us. We were in the cone of uncertainty. Now there's a lot of reasons why they call that and we're gonna to touch on that in just a second. My hair is all screwed up. Probably because I do this all the time. Now the reason we did that was this weekend just so happens to be Mary's birthday, right? So there's a lot, a lot of things going on this weekend. Mary's birthday, her 30th birthday nonetheless. I actually had a big weekend planned. We were gonna go on a trip up in the mountains in the middle of nowhere and just kind of hang out and do nothing for a few days. Then had to get postponed because we had some other expenses that came up that we needed to use the money for boring expenses so it's not as fun so then after that I rescheduled I repurposed her birthday so to speak and I scheduled her a bunch of things to do and like a mommy day like a spa mommy day so we ran getting to my mom's house we were nice and cozy everything was fine so we went to sleep Thursday night woke up Friday Palm Beach County was in this cone of uncertainty this thing that is always so uncertain. So, Friday morning, Mary and my mom are in a panic. Oh my God! Okay, it's happening. Everybody, stay calm. What's the Everybody procedure, everyone? Calm. What's the procedure? Stay calm. So we all pack up, get in the car, and we run back to my house up in Central Florida. Friday was pretty much compromised of traveling back to my house, more preparing. We went to the store, buy water, buy bread, buy blah blah blah. <sighs> with my mom and Emma in tow. Where are they? There they are. So that. So, so far, Mary's birthday weekend has been terrible. Saturday is when the birthday fun kind of starts. Saturday we wake up, really nothing to do. We're kind of, we're all prepared, we're all ready. We're all in a supposedly safe spot, but not really, because the cone of uncertainty has us dead center. So, Saturday, we're like, what can we do for some fun? Let's get over this hurricane. It's still not gonna be here till like Tuesday. So it's part of Mary's birthday fun to Animal Kingdom. And we had to go to Animal Kingdom. We didn't even go to Animal Kingdom. She rushed in and rushed out because we had to, had to, had to get the Simba magnet, which I was told as of today, the Simba magnet is no more. So we're lucky that we got one of the Simba magnets. After we ran to Animal Kingdom, now this was like later in the day. Went to Animal Kingdom, went to Cats Connection to see if we could get any good deals on anything. Because I actually bought, I bought a new desk at a cast connection. This big desk, it was a quarter. I'll have to show you this desk. It's a huge desk for a quarter. It's pretty amazing. We made reservations for Spirit of Aloha. Had a fantastic dinner over at the Polynesian. Watched a little show, watched a little dancing, watched a little fire breathing. It was a good old time. All you can eat, all you can drink. Who can not love that? Emma, Emma, you want to wave? Wave. Hi. It's just funny the way you eat. A pair of split bamboo reeds, cold to eat, and these bamboo gourds come to enjoy the moku eka.
think I ate way too much food. I gotta walk. I gotta walk like this. Wait, you have to walk like this out of the thing? What, I'm not repeating that. What, what was your favorite part of the show? Oh, that guy on the end, the laugh to the, the thing and the sweat with the, and the with whole. The big tattoo on his, his pec. Pec, but what's his pectoral pack? What's it called? His pectoral pack. Yep, his pectoral pack. <laughs> yeah, that's what it's called. Is that the scientific name? <laughs> just say, just call it Maui. After that, followed by Sephora, where Mary spent like oodles and oodles of dollars on cream, which I still don't understand why some. Some makeup costs five dollars, other makeup costs thirty-five dollars. I still don't understand. You understand? But you buy it. I brought it back and I got the eight dollar mascara and the four dollar eyeshadow at Walmart. What? I'm just documenting your Mommy you guys smell this one. Here's my lip. What are we getting? No, close it. Are you mad at me? No. What are we getting? Stop. What? What do we need? What do we need? No, they don't have any more. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Birthday ruins. I don't know about you guys, but Mary always makes me come into these stores. Usually I wait outside. She's pretty happy about it, but these, these, uh, what is this, like makeup skincare stores, this is so poor. Give me a pounding headache between all the perfume and other odors that are around here. It's absolutely ridiculous. You're getting sucked in, too? I can't even breathe in here. What do you need? Look at my face. Everything. Remember that one? Yeah. Remember that one time at the White Mall you spent like six hundred dollars yes, on did. bull crap? I would do it again. Those are supposedly really good. <laughs> so I know Ratchet is a good Um what else are we talking about? As far as other symptoms, acne, redness, and but it's been calm, so it happens. It comes up, then it goes away. So okay. it's kind of like so we're in a good spot right now. Right now we are. I mean, okay. it, it could be could be way worse. <laughs> but don't be nervous. Okay, that's good. Oh, oh, super fashionable. Fancy. I mean, that was cool. The easiest way, yeah, doing stuff like that. Um. Like this? Like this? Perfect. Okay. Do you have Fancy. any specific goals for your skincare of the type of redness and like uh, the, the acne and everything? I hate wearing makeup. I like to go like, do I look fancy? Like, woohoo! I would like to just put like a little powder on, some mascara, and walk out the door. So we, want, we all want perfect skin. Um, what's keeping you from doing that right now? Why do you feel like your skin doesn't look the right now? Red skin. So look at products that look like red And then. The darkness under the eyes. Yeah. There. So we're gonna start with a cleanser. This is the Use with People cleanser. It's my all-time favorite. Last year, I won the Aladdin Magazine Award for best cleanser um, for twenty green tea and then vitamins in it. So the kale is gonna boost your skin's overall health. The green tea is a natural toner to help with acne. And the spinach and aloe in here is good for anti-redness and for cooling your skin. Okay. So this gets a lot of your concern. I'm sorry, I'm allergic to bullshit. Um, you're wearing a tinted moisturizer, right? I forgot because it looks like your skin. Um, yeah. I'm gonna actually. I don't know how to zoom in. Manually? Yeah. I really? Is that a lot of time? Why? Um, so an eye cream is really important. We always recommend that people start eye creams in their early 20s. A lot of people think it's like an old lady thing. Way past like that. she's 30 today. Yeah, so two, the, Monday. Oh yeah, Monday. Well, that's fine, because you're, you're still in pretty good shape as far as your face, so you're you're fine. Um, but it's good to start it now so it doesn't get worse. I better start a right away. anti-aging on skincare, and they think that means that it's reverse aging. There's no such thing. Uh, anti-aging is preventative, so you're doing it now to stop the aging from getting more rapid. Gotcha. You should probably take out the nose right now that you're 32. I like the nose. <laughs> <laughs> 
not coming out. I know. No. I just want to add them. use the, um, the, the pads, or, or is that your first time getting them? I've used them before. Okay, good. I'm actually just replenishing them. Perfect. <laughs> I'm like fancy with my head wrap. You want to keep it? Yeah. Basically what this is, this is a nice little serum on a rollerball. The serum is going to be for brightening, hydrating, and exfoliation. And then the tube is going to be a little vacuum. So it's going to suck away all the exfoliated skin and everything out of your pores. That's so freaky. Yeah. Oh god. Oh. Mm -hmm. So it's like a ball? It's literally it's sucking my face. Mm -hmm. That is so weird. Well, you're right next to the gun and you want it. That is weird. <laughs> that is weird. <laughs> Um, basically what it does is it soothes the skin and kind of gives it a good defense where it's stronger against things like stress or home hormones or um, pollution from the air. Um, it's also got a nice little shade moisturizer too. That's why it's so cloudy. So it's giving you hydration, it's giving you balance, it's giving you everything you need. You can do this throughout the day. I do this literally all the time while I'm at work. I love this stuff. Um, but it's perfect for after the treatment because it helps turn on the redness, helps soothe the skin after, you know, the vacuum's a little bit invasive. It's not as bad as like microdermabrasion. That's a lot. Um, oh, there's something worse than that? Oh, yeah. Oh, I know. Oh, yeah. That. that wasn't even the highest setting. Oh, yeah. We're going to apply your skincare overall, and then at the end, we're going to take those off and put the high cream yeah. right on top. Oh, you're me. So, the first thing we're going to use is the Sega Care Anti Redness Serum from Dr. George. This one is super easy. What is it? And it makes your that's, redness come down. That's my age, age defying face cream. Oh, they have a bowl? It's going to stimulate your skin. Yeah. <laughs> and it's going to push it in so it goes through the deepest layers of your skin instead of just sliding it. Wow, Mimi, your face is dead. Your face is dead. I got a lot of years on it. Let me do that on this one. So now they are officially done. Let's see what they look like. I already showed you, but I'll show you again because it's fun. I got the primer. Oh, it's it. up here. Oh, you yeah. did the disc? I, I put in the date in the store and everything. Oh, okay, okay. okay. Let's keep going. The reason that her face is all red because he put like all this kind of stuff on it so it got irritated. Okay, I'm done. Bye. Now, as it sits today, on Sunday, Dorian is a category 5, 220 mile per hour wind and is currently blasting through the Bahamas feels so bad for those people it is crazy I've watched some footage and it's absolutely not and we're still in the corner of uncertainty so we're a little worried I don't mean like how worried can you be you're at Disney right but it is still Mary's birthday so she wanted to come to Magic Kingdom to try and have some fun and that brings us to right now right this second Happy, Happy birthday. birthday! What birthday is it? It's my 21st birthday The sign's down no, Mary, can you please take me a picture of me? Mary, can you please? You gotta start singing. No, you do it. Start singing. No, you do it. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, little Mary. Happy 30th birthday. 20, Happy I see two seven. to you. Do it. Any day now.